Hello everybody, how are you today? It is Power Week. It means the Power BI team has released a new Power BI desktop download or upload or whatever you want to call it. And we're going to review it. So um, how about we get started? So hello, welcome back. This February update for me is basically visualization, 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 which I absolutely adore. And they've made a fantastic job with the updates that they've given us. So that's what we're going to review today. The visualization features that they've released for February. I think they're absolutely great. So first of all, uh, we will go through the you know, they have added formatted features, um, additional formatting features for the filter panel. But first of all, I want to show you how to get that filter panel because you've been asking me a thousand times. I actually wish that they put this by default. Why do you have to come here and check it? I don't know. So you go to options, report settings, and then you click in there. Enable the updated filter pane, blah, blah. And then boom, it shows there, okay? And then you cannot drag hints into the pane. You have to drag them to the report filters for now. So we will go and pick here, for example, and then it shows up up there, okay? So those are the changes. And what they've done is that you can color it and you can, I recommend you not to, leave it. Leave it like it is. You have other things to do on the dashboard and better lose the time there than coloring a filter pane my two cents but if you want to color them go for it you can do it now okay so we have um yeah you know online charts before let me put no that was not good let me put the category no custom there yeah excellent so before when you pick these you and you were doing cross filtering you know it pick everything like that but now you can also if you continue clicking you can pick just one point instead of picking everything right there you go i mean it's super weird but you, you can anyhow so i don't know who's going to go there and pick but if you're going to do it you can so, next one, titles, word wrap. So, if we make this smaller, you can see how this is not wrapping, so you, you don't see the entire title. You have now on the formatting pane and the title a word wrap, and as you can see, it wraps the title, so you can see everything. Good, very good, very good. Um, next one. We're going to talk about rounder corner for visual borders. Um, I actually wanted to do this this week for a customer. And I didn't want to do it for visuals. I, I don't mind that visuals are square, but you know, when you put these inside boxes or common boxes, those I would like to have rounded. And I was thinking, oh no, it says visuals. Maybe it's not possible for text box. Well, look at this. I wish that we could put more radius on it, but I'm being picky. I'm honestly, I'm being picky. This is fantastic. Thank you. And the grand finale. I'm so happy about this. I, I, I could kill for it. It's, you know, when you are cross filtering, I pick that one and you see how everything is highlighted instead of cross filtering, which is a pain because for every report I deliver, I have to go through each visual that highlights and change that because more often than not, you're going to find empty fields. It's very rare that I actually want to have um, highlighting instead of cross filtering. It happens, but not very often. So if you go to file options and settings, options again, unfortunately, you know how so many settings that I'm doing for every new file that I'm preparing a video for it. This is now on my bucket list. So um, 
I have to find what that is. Uh, here, visual options change, default visual interaction from cross filtering to cross highlighting. And then if I click again, oh, hallelujah! <laughs> this is so good, fantastic, very, very good. Th this is my favorite feature of the February update by far the round corners super neat amazing what is your favorite feature let me know in the comment box and uh, i'll see you again tomorrow i'm not going to review the analytics pane tomorrow i will do it next week because then friday is tax fridays but we'll see you tomorrow either way so take care and uh, I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.